Planet Fitness, your road trip friend. The girls are in there still getting a massage, spa day. Then it's on to the Blue Ridge Parkway. <laughs> This is it, just turned on to the Blue Ridge Parkway. And the sun came out. Okay, dinner's coming up in a little bit, so stay tuned. <laughs> All right, so that is for the green beans. And so for the green beans, and this is uh, not the way we planned this meal. This was gonna be cooked in one of those hot logic things, but we don't have enough power to do that. And the salmon and stuff needs to be eaten. So we're having a, what'd you call it? Butterfly meal? Butterfly meal <laughs> because we're doing it as right. we go. So we're using No their, plans. No plans. <laughs> So I am spraying a little, this is just plain olive oil uh -huh. that I'm spraying in this big old thing here. And we don't want the flame too, too high, but we are cooking these green beans that a few days ago were frozen. And now they're not Do they frozen. need a little water so they don't burn? Maybe. Yeah. A good call and again feel free to jump in at any time <laughs> all right root deal can I put somebody else in charge of those you want to just heat those or stir them when needed all right and then we're using this rice that's normally microwavable I've never tried What's the it? name earthly grains mm -hmm. we okay. got this at Aldi's okay so it was gonna be cooked in that hot logic thing Jan said it might need water, but... Yeah, see if it's chewy. Mm -hmm. Too chewy? Not too chewy? Not for me. Taste it. Kind of hard. Is that too hard for you? Yeah. So you want to add more water to yeah. that? How yep. much? Say when. A couple tablespoons. It'll absorb while cooking. That's good. Takes a village. <laughs> And I'm glad I asked if you're using other people's things. Please always ask because it's annoying. This is Lee's skillet and my stove and, and her stove. My so, stove and her stove. stove. I was asking if I could use this in her pan, and she said, "Well, if you won't scratch it." I was like, okay, "I've got a plastic one." What I heard was yeah, no. Is. Yeah. And so I'm using my plastic one or whatever this is. All right, so while that rice is cooking, all right, so while that's cooking, we are going to cut up the salmon. And one of the best purchases I've ever made, I have a pair at home and a pair for camping. Kitchen. Yeah. And our goal with cooking is trying to get cooked and cleaned up so nothing wants to come get us tonight. Right, gotta watch out for those does. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> and the does what come after us at night and attack the car. Oh, now, now we do know bears like salmon. Now, come on. <laughs> we're we're cooking on cans. 
sight. Oh, that's right. So the bears will be after me. <laughs> you and Coco got it. If you're better at cooking it, oh, look at me. See, I almost threw the plastic, the paper in there. Okay, in goes the salmon. And then spray some more oil on it. And then that, oh my I'm touching Lee's stuff with my salmon fingers. So her sea salt here. Pink, pink Himalayan sea. pink. Salt. Yeah, that's If I were doing this at home, I would have seasoned this before I put it in the pan, but we're on the fly. We're on the fly and in a hurry to not burn anything. Dill, at this point, is you put the dill on? Yep, oh, it's not mine. open. Oh no! Can we turn that down any? I don't know. But low is good. Is it still on? I don't know. I think yeah, so. This all. Oh. Ding ding, they're cooking away. Are they boiling probably, aren't they? No, I don't think so. They steam. The good news is if there's any leftover green beans, we can, those can be used tomorrow. All right, so on the, goes the dill. The dill is going on. Turn it on the right. Yeah, the dill on the rice. Say so if you want more, feel free to pick that up and do more. And we I'm have gonna, lemon later to And I'm gonna try to remember Ramona not to ruin the, the, their food with this because I put my pepper in this thing and one day I made two eggs camping and went, oh put pepper on me. There is no that's not a sprinkle. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> And I'm big on pepper, so I don't want to hurt anybody. All right. Good. Oh, so doesn't it smell good? It does. All right, where is this? Why does it always taste better outside, everybody says? I know. It's better it outside. Is it the fresh air? Oh, that looks so good and smells so good. Yeah, good. So we're going to have this and the green beans. And uh, we'll see what happens after that. Watermelon for dessert because we gotta get rid of the watermelon. Some people like um, to cut off that silver part yes. uh, before they cook it. I actually like that part. There's mm -hmm. a lot of flavor there. Mm -hmm. So to each his own. But this is a definite butterfly. Yeah, meal. The plan is to go. It's like, okay, we had a different plan. We don't, we can't do that plan, but we need to use that food we bought when we had that plan. Yeah. And the rice is getting a little on the bottom. I like that. I hope that that's okay with y'all. It's all good. How is it, Ramona? So good. Yeah. Mm. Delicious. Delicious, delicious. Add a little lemon on it. Mm-hmm. Some Caesar salad. Some watermelon for dessert. Some and those green beans that were frozen before and we just added water to that pan. They're great. Mm, very good. And I put the lemon on them too. Excellent. Off we go on to the next adventure. Join us for the next episode of the Rolling Meetup. Let me know in the comments if you think van life sucks. <laughs> See you in the next episode. Bye.